Yo, what's up guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel and in today's video we're back with another strike pack video I'm gonna show you guys how to connect like the touchpad because as soon as you do the strike pack process it doesn't let you do use the touchpad for some reason but I'm gonna show you guys but for those of you guys that are new and don't even know how to do the normal process I'm just gonna show you guys the faster version because I have videos on that already but uh, basically all you have to do is go to the first link in the description that says download SCP toolkit then you just press download here then it's gonna bring you to this side it takes kind of like a while then you click on not SCP toolkit setup exp you don't click that you just click download anyway So yeah, I'm just going to show you guys how to install it real quick so you're not confused. All you need to do is you need the cable and you need your strike pack to be plugged in your controller the proper way. You make sure this clicks, mm. it makes that sound, you make sure it clicks. Then you go here where it says SCP Toolkit Driver Installer, you click this one, this one because we're not using Bluetooth and we're not using DualShock 3 controller, we're using the PS4 controller. Then you say choose the stuff to install. So basically you're just looking for a way it says wireless, like the first word has to be wireless, like wireless controller, not controller wireless. So like wireless, de -de 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 -de. then we look for wireless. It normally has two. Sometimes it's right under, under one another, but it doesn't really matter. Then all you need to do is just press install and it's gonna show one, two, three. It normally shows three but this is the first installation obviously because i uninstalled it then yeah but for some of you it shows you some errors here i tried to help someone a few days ago like his thing downloaded properly there was nothing but when he installs it it was showing some errors i don't know how to fix those ones i don't want to like tell you guys the wrong stuff and mess up your whole computer so right now the strike pack is working right uh before i show you guys the touchpad i'm looking for it not the updater there's another one the settings tool, yeah, this settings one, uh, to reduce input delay, like here, check where you guys' one is, mine is on 300, like the lowest input delay, just check where you guys' one is, and this one as well, latency, make sure you put it all the way to zero, because to make you have like lower input delay, because you know, some people say the strike bike has input delay. And here you can change like the brightness and blah 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 and there's no need to save you just exit out of it then when you want to use the touchpad you know because as soon as you do this the touchpad doesn't work but mine is gonna work obviously now but for you guys it's not gonna so anyway you just go to this link in the description then you press where it says uh, central mod configuration tool for strike back you click on this then you download it then when it's finished downloading you open it up notice when you open it up everything is gray because your controller is still plugged in with the strike bag weirdly enough for this process you gotta take your controller out you hear me then I'm gonna close it oh I think it's doing something now it's showing the controller you feel me I'm not tweaking this settings just like it's still plugged in just this one then uh for you guys it's gonna show for you guys it's gonna show touch here and share here all you need to do is click on this and touch share then this to automatically change then don't you don't need to do anything else you just cancel then exit this you don't really need that again now when you want to connect your strike back again because you took this out you have to plug it back in it's gonna make a sound i think no okay then you have to open up this again i'm actually gonna unplug it first pull then i plug it back in again pow then you're gonna have to open up scp toolkit like you have to plug your controller in before you open up the scp toolkit or the wireless is not gonna show then you just connect the wireless and you press install then that's how it works it shows no error for me it shows nothing let me show you guys in game how it works Ah, ah, ah. 
Let me give you a bar. Yeah, yeah, yo. Subscribe to my YouTube, Shape of Five. If you don't, I will not be happy. So please do it for me. This is kind of cringe, so I'm gonna stop. <clears throat>